In parts of East Africa, one of the biggest challenges for pregnant women is simply surviving. Health care is a luxury and almost impossible to come by. Most mothers, though, deliver on their own. Most die on their own. They die of some what we call postpartum hemorrhage. After the baby is born, they exsanguinate. For years, Dr. Robert Whaley and his team have been fighting this problem in Kenya. They developed a model called Project Isiolo, which was discussed during Modern Care's international meeting in Rome. It's a simple yet effective healthcare system where workers directly talk to villagers about their biggest concerns. They need professionally trained people, midwives and doctors, to look after them. And that has to be as close to the mother in the village as possible. There are no taxis, no buses, no roads and so on. Worldwide, roughly 330,000 women die every year during childbirth. The biggest problem is lack of health care, but Dr. Whaley says amid this tragedy, there are those who are pushing their own interests. The international community says, oh yes, we're going to do something about the fifth millennium development goal. We're going to lower maternal mortality. So what do they do? They want to push abortion and birth control. Another challenge is funding. Governments and some international groups often shy away from giving grants to religious organizations. So Dr. Whaley says the group mostly relies on individual donations. In African villages, the Catholic Church provides roughly 40% of all health care services.